In today's demo, we are going to discuss the uh, new employee being added to a system and then how to assign this employee a cash drawer to use in the bowling center. So the first thing we will do is we are going to set up a brand new employee. Click on user accounts. We're going to say new and we're going to say bartender Jane is the employee. And just to keep it simple, I'm not going to go through all the security levels for this person, but we're going to create this employee, and then we're going to go over to our configuration manager and set this person up to use a cash drawer. Now we are going to click on the configuration manager, and we are going to go to our devices tab, and then we are going to work on the cash drawers in the bowling center. Now, you have several workstation computers over here. IBCMS is the main computer, and then we have eight more workstations that are throughout the building. I'm going to click on Manage, and this is where you can manage all of the cash drawer names. If we know that this is in the bar, we can rename it. We can add a brand new cash drawer, and we can also remove a cash drawer. We can also say that a cash drawer is a wallet, and when it is a wallet, we can assign who this wallet belongs to. We could say that it belongs to the bartender, Jane. So it's, it's kind of like a portable cash drawer, you might say. That's why we call it a wallet. Okay, so that's what wallet is. And then after we have set up all of this information, we can click on OK. And now we can go over to our individual terminals and set up the cash drawers. And all of our terminals here have been set up already. PC number two has got a bar terminal, a bar cash drawer. PC three has got a, a drawer called PC three drawer. And if we wanted to, we could also uh, assume that on PC number five, there are two cash drawers. PC5 drawer 1 is the name, and PC5 drawer number 2 is the name of our second drawer. Okay? Now, I want to talk about the working drawers button over here, and this is where you assign which employees can open up which drawer in the system. So if I click on working drawers, you can see here that the bartender Jane that we just created has not been assigned which cash drawer she can open up. So we just put in two cash drawers, and we're going to say that the bartender Jane can only open up drawer number two. You can only pick one or the other. You can't have multiple drawers for the same person. All we have to do now is click on Save, and all of our uh, configurations for a new employee and cash drawer management have been saved. That's all. Thank you.